My love for Britain can be described as an angsty kind of love. One that reminds me to keep loving despite its flaws. It's a love tightly contained within the orange brick walls of London, the first city I called home. And though sometimes the stillness can be quite mundane, it's still home to me. I am reminded of love every time I see a sunset. And in the quiet second before the roaring noise begins at a concert, in the hushed whispers on the tube and quiet laughter of friends on the streets, my love for London is in all of the city's folded corners and burnt edges. It is in the estates I grew up in, the communities that raised me, in the stalls of the markets that are unchanging. I wondered how I would be able to express love for Britain when I've only seen a fraction of it. And I suppose like people, love for country is not one that you're born with, but it's one that you learn. And I've learned to love this country through the beautiful and sometimes simple buzz of this city.